Hey guys, back again. Just want to talk a little bit about the sheepskin that I sometimes wear. Um, especially on cold, cold days like it is today. It's uh, just about minus 30. I actually got this coat um, for a killer deal on uh, Kijiji. It's a Baden Christensen. They don't have a website right now, but it's um, being created, so they should have one up and running soon. Uh, you can find them at uh, other stores though, some, some stores carry them. I only paid $75 for this, but it's like a $600 coat. Um, it's a genuine shearling sheepskin. So the inside is the wool, 100%, and then the outside is the leather. Um, they have different finishes. Some of them are uh, uh, a suede, and some of them are not. This is actually an, uh, one that isn't a suede, but from me working and rubbing lots of wood up against the front of it, it's kind of started to suede itself. But uh, if you just uh, re-oil it every now and then, it pretty much goes back to how it, it, it came when I bought it. They hold up quite nice. Uh, I have put a few little nicks in them here and there when I caught it on a, a nail here and there, stuff like that, but uh, still they hold up really nice. One of the key features about having uh, full leather on the outside is if you're working with uh, abrasive materials like uh, wood and stuff like that and you're rubbing it up against yourself a lot, then uh, they don't get the wood splinters stuck into the wool, like in something like this. And uh, say maybe around the farm too, if you're working with a lot of hay and hay dust, then uh, it wipes off real easy or doesn't stick as much as it would with, say, one of those wool garments. Um, another cool thing about it is uh, when there's a lot of wind or really hard blowing snow, um, it, it is a really good wind block. So uh, you can still layer underneath it if you need to, but I normally always just have a t-shirt underneath, just like right now. Like I said, it's almost minus 30, and I just have my one lightweight Alaskan guide shirt underneath, and I'm plenty warm, no issues. Another cool feature about these things is uh, usually they have a, a high neck, and then you can uh, cinch it closed like this. So it's like a built-in neck warmer. Cuts the cold off real nice. They have like different heights and stuff like that. Um, absolutely love it. It's uh, all brass hardware on it. It actually has a zip-on hood too, but I took it off and normally don't use it, but most of them do come with a hood as well. Um, the sides cinch, you can adjust them on a lot of them. Um, this one's actually oversized for me. This is actually a large. I could probably fit a medium, no problem. But it gives room for a little bit of uh, layering if I need to, but I, I haven't had to at all. So um, they're quite warm coats. I'm not exactly sure right now where you can buy this one or this brand, um, but there is lots of different stores that do carry the Baden Christensen. But if you could just get a genuine sheepskin shearling, um, it's an awesome coat. Just get a well-made one by a reputable manufacturer, even lower-end manufacturer, I'm sure. It's going to be a nice coat. And you can definitely find them for good deals on, uh, you know, buy and sell pages and stuff like that used. So that's where I got this one, 75 bucks. Killer deal. Now this one only has two pockets on the outside here. No inner pockets, which is fine don't really need to be going in there. It doesn't breathe as well as say one of these, but I mean when it's super cold like this, it doesn't seem to get any moisture on the inside or excessive moisture on the inside, uh, unless you're gonna be doing really heavy activity, but then you just open up the zipper a little bit and that moisture can get out. Um, it does still breathe depending on what you keep coating it with. Um, it mine seems to breathe not too bad though.
I don't really have too much else to say about it right now. Um, if I think anything else, maybe I'll do an update video. If you guys have any questions about it, just ask me in the comment section. Thanks again for watching my